There are people who believe America can't build things anymore, that our cities, workers, products, and technology can't cut it in the global economy. They believe American ingenuity doesn't count for much. Others can do it better now, and that we are destined to become a nation of paper shufflers, burger flippers, pixel pushers. This is the story of some people who believe something different. These are people who believe in the American craftsmen because they are American craftsmen. They are people who transformed a factory by holding on to their values while modernizing their methods. Their product is rolling across six continents now. They are the people who build Harley Davidson motorcycles right here in America. There's a lot of pride in, in, in the employees here at, at, at the York plant. We've you know, put our blood, sweat, and tears to, to make the product that we make. We definitely show the world that we have pride in our craftsmanship uh, and that we are the benchmark, not necessarily watching everybody else and how they do it. There's going to be a time when everybody looks at Harley Davidson and say, that's the way I want to run my company. These people are the reason Harley-Davidson motorcycles are now built with cutting-edge processes and technologies. And they're building a factory to run at a pace that would tucker out any other factory in the world. We always strive to make something better, but we all have to work together in that group to make that section of the line work as best as we can. We don't want nothing going out past us that's not what we would want to ride as an employee that ride Harley-Davidson's. They are the people who did what it took, putting their noses to the grindstone to keep the traditions rolling forward. And they are the reason people around the world know what it feels like to throw a leg over the saddle and ride. Harley-Davidson motorcycles go worldwide. It's something that's uh, truly an American dream. Don't matter if you're 16 or if you're 66, uh, air's gonna feel good. Anywhere you go, everybody's got a right to freedom. If you go out and get on your bike, you're free. They are the people who turn cold steel into Harley Davidson motorcycles and export freedom to the world. This is what America can do.